Hello everyone and very welcome to this course. My name is Zishan Hussain and I will be your instructor in this drop servicing course. This is the first lecture of this course and in this lecture I will be answering these important questions. So this will be a very very important lecture and I am highly recommending you to watch this lecture completely. This lecture will give you a complete idea and understanding about online drop servicing business as well as about this drop servicing with WordPress course. So first of all, this online drop servicing business doesn't require any investment. So there is no risk of loss in this business. Now what is online drop servicing business? How to get clients for free? Recruiting affiliates to put this business on autopilot? Getting thousands of clients visiting your website for free? How much is the income from this business? How to start this business? Designing your drop servicing website with WordPress. So these are some important topics that I will be discussing one by one in this lecture. So first of all, what is drop servicing? So drop servicing is also called service arbitrage. This is a new business model in which you find clients who need services but the clients does not know that you will find a third party or a freelancer to complete that service. So in simple words, in drop servicing business, you create a landing page on your website and you publish some services on your website landing page. The services you provide on your website could be about anything, for example creating websites, building apps, designing logos, video animations for advertisements, video editing, graphic designing, etc, etc. Now when a client land on your website and he order a service from you, let's say for example the customer order a $500 service from your website. So after receiving the order, you take the order details and you send it to a freelancer on freelancing websites like Piver.com upwork.com or freelancer.com. The freelancer does the job for you, let's say on $100. So after completing the project, the freelancer send it to you and you forward the project to your customer. You pay $100 to your freelancer and the remaining $400 is your profit and goes to your pocket. So this is how simple is drop servicing business. You do nothing but you work as an intermediate between the clients and the service providers. Now if you go to Fiverr.com, so here you will see thousands of freelancer for any type of services on very cheap prices. So you can easily find a good freelancer from here to complete the services for you which you receive from your clients. For example, if I click on graphic and design category, and here if I choose business card design category. So here you will see hundreds of freelancers available to design business cards for you on very cheap prices like $10 and $20. So you can easily sell this business card designing service on your website for $80 and $100. And when you receive an order from your client, so you can send the order details to a freelancer here and after the freelancer complete the service, he will send it to you and you will forward it to your client. We will discuss this later in this course that how will you deal with a freelancer on Fiverr.com. So for drop servicing, all you need to have is a landing page to collect orders from clients, which I will teach you later how to create a professional and highly responsive landing page with WordPress. And the second thing is how to get clients to your website to get orders. So for getting clients, I will be sharing with you now three mastermind strategies. The first two strategies are free. So using those two strategies, you will get hundreds and thousands of clients to your landing page for free every day. And the third strategy, which obviously everybody know is paid marketing, but I will tell you something different about paid marketing and we will discuss that in a moment. So the first strategy to get clients for free is to recruit affiliates. Before we discuss this strategy, 
I will briefly explain to you that what is affiliate marketing and who are affiliates. So affiliate marketing is the type of marketing in which one promote the products or services of other people and earn a commission when he make a sale for them. And the persons who are doing this kind of marketing are known as affiliates or publishers. So recruiting affiliate means that you will recruit individual like bloggers and YouTubers on your website as affiliates and they will promote your services on their blogs or in their YouTube videos and you will not pay anything to the affiliates until they bring you a sale. That's mean that you will pay them a commission only when they make a successful sale of your service. To better understand this concept of affiliate marketing. I will give you an example of Amazon.com. If you know Amazon.com, it is providing affiliate marketing system on their website. So if you sign up on Amazon.com as an affiliate, so Amazon will provide you a unique affiliate link which goes to their website but that link contain a special tracking code. Now when you are promoting Amazon products as an affiliate. So you will use this unique link to send traffic to Amazon.com and that traffic will be tracked on Amazon website and if any sale is generated, so that sale will count toward your promotion and Amazon will pay you a commission for that sale. So this whole system is called affiliate marketing. Now if you have the same affiliate marketing system on your own drop servicing website. So you also can recruit affiliates to promote your website and you will pay them a commission only when they make a sale for you. For example, you are providing a business card designing service on your website for $150. And you have hired a freelancer on Power.com to do this job for you on $30. Now let's suppose an affiliate made a sale for you. And let's say you are providing 20% commission to your affiliates. So you receive $150 from the customer and you pay $30 to the freelancer who does the job for you to design a business card as per the customer requirements. And you pay 20% that is $30 to the affiliate because he bring that customer to you. So 150 minus 30 minus 30 equal to $90 which is your profit in this one order and you have done nothing because the affiliate bring you the customer and the freelancer complete their service. The only thing you do is to forward the order details to the freelancer and after the freelancer complete it, you took it from him and forward it to the customer. Now there are two questions. First of all, how will you add this affiliate marketing functionality to your drop servicing website? And the second thing is how will you get affiliates to sign up on your website so that they start promoting your services as an affiliate. So adding the affiliate marketing system to your drop servicing website is very simple and easy. There is nothing difficult in it. You can do it just by installing, activating and configuring a plugin on your WordPress website and then you can easily recruit affiliates. You can track the traffic to your website from the affiliates and the sales they make for you. So all this system will be automatic. Only in the beginning you will configure the plugin to work the way you want it. We will discuss this later in detail in this course that how will you do this. Now the second thing is how to get affiliates. So first of all I will tell you that if you recruit some affiliates on your drop servicing website. So you will see very very good results from it. Because one affiliate can send you thousands of potential customers every month. We will discuss this in a moment that how will affiliates send you thousands of potential customers but first we will discuss how to recruit affiliates. So for recruiting affiliates, first of all you will need to source affiliates using Google and YouTube. So open Google and search a keyword of the service you are providing on your website. You know that Google is pull up information. So if you are providing any type of services on your drop servicing website, you will find thousands of relevant blogs, articles and YouTube videos on that topic. Let's say for demonstration, we are providing a service of designing business cards 
on our drop servicing website. Later in this course we will discuss how to choose the best niche for your drop servicing business. But for now, let's suppose we are providing a service of designing business cards. So if I search in Google, tips on how to design a business card. So you can see Google show me a lot of results here. So these are blogs from bloggers who are speaking in their blog post about the thing for which we are providing a service. Now you will open these blog posts one by one and you will go to the contact page of these blogs to send an email to the blogger and you will ask them to sign up as an affiliate on your website and you will tell them that they can make money only by adding a link in their blog to our drop servicing website. We will discuss that in a while how to do that but first I will tell you one thing here that when you are searching a keyword in Google so Google will show you top results based on your location. As here you can see these are the results based on my location as I am in the UAE. Now the problem is that I can contact here only 10 or maximum 20 bloggers to ask them to sign up as an affiliate on our website. While our aim should be to contact more bloggers to get more affiliate sign up on our drop servicing website. And also our aim should be to contact top bloggers and by top bloggers I mean bloggers whose blogs are coming on the top in the Google search results for our keyword. Because these top blogs have high traffic as compared to the blogs coming on the second or third page of Google search results. So to get more and top blogs from different location, you will click here on the setting button and then here you will click on advanced search. And then you will scroll down a little and here in the region field you will choose countries one by one. So first let's say I will choose India here. Then I will scroll down. So now if I click on advanced search so Google will show me top results on this keyword in India. So I will click on advanced search. So now these results include the high rank blogs on Google in India on the keyword tips for designing business card. So from here you will contact the top 10 bloggers and then again you will change the search from India to UK, then US, then Canada, Australia and so on. So in each country you will contact the top bloggers who have a blog post on your keyword. Now the first benefit of using this method is you will contact a big number of top bloggers on your keyword in each different country. The second benefit is that you will contact only high rank blogs because the blogs which are coming on top in the search results of Google have high traffic and if a blog have high traffic so you will get a lot of customers from that blog to your drop servicing website if the blogger of that blog is promoting your service in that blog post. Now how to contact a blogger and how to ask them to sign up as an affiliate on our website. So to do this, open these blogs one by one and first of all copy the URL of this blog post because we will add this URL in the email to the blogger. So I will copy it from here. Now go to the contact page of this blog post. So if I scroll down. So here is the contact us page from where we can contact this blogger. So I will click on contact us. Now here you can write your name and in the email field you will write your email. But keep in mind that you will contact the bloggers from your professional email, the email associated with your website domain name. For example, if your website domain name is www.designcards.com, then your email should be something like admin at designcards.com or info at designcards.com or support at designcards.com. So you will not contact the bloggers from your Gmail or Hotmail because that doesn't look professional. 
and how to create your own domain professional email we will discuss that later in this course so for demonstration i will write here something like affiliate at designcards.com and if they are asking you about your website so you can add your website link here and then you will write the message here now the message that you will write here i will recommend you to create a template message in wordpad or in ms word and save it on your computer so every time you are contacting a new blogger you will simply copy the template message and you will paste it here so it will save your time by writing a same message again and again. Now how to write this message? I will guide you from the slide. So in the message body you will write, Hi dear blogger, I just read your this blog post and then paste the link of that blog post here which we copied earlier so that the blogger know which blog post you are talking about. Then write something like, You have a really nice post on designing business cards I really like it. I am the admin of the website www.designcards.com and on our website we are providing services to customers who need to design business cards for their businesses. We also provide an affiliate program on our website and we pay our affiliate 30% commission on each sale they give us. We have a very good affiliate tracking system with 90 days cookies period and we pay our affiliate at the end of every month through PayPal. You have a really nice post relevant to the service we are providing. We are wondering if you sign up as an affiliate on our website. After signing up as an affiliate, you just need to copy your unique affiliate link and add it to your post and recommend it to your visitors if they need to buy a service for designing business card. We are sure that you will generate a good revenue as an affiliate with our website because the visitors of your blog will love our services. Now after this, you will guide the blogger on how to sign up as an affiliate on your website. So you will write something like, Signing up as an affiliate on our website is very easy. Just click on the below link. This link will take you to our affiliate sign up page in the sign up page provide your name, email address and your PayPal email and click on sign up. After signing up you can copy your unique affiliate link from the dashboard and you can add that link in your this blog post. Hence any of your visitor click on that link and make a purchase on our website within 90 days of clicking the link we will pay you 30% commission on each sale. We are looking forward to see you in our affiliate team. If you have any question regarding our affiliate program, please write to us on affiliate at designcards.com. We will be happy to assist you. Now to make it easy, just copy this whole text and save it with you in a word pile on your computer. So you don't need to write the same message again and again when you are contacting another blogger. Simply you will copy and paste this text but remember to change the URL of the post in the message every time you are contacting a new blogger. Now I will copy this whole text from here and then I will add it here in the message body. And then I will click on the submit button to send this email to this blogger. Now sometimes the bloggers will reply and will ask you more about the affiliate program but in most cases they will directly go on your website and will sign up as an affiliate and you will see their details in your WordPress dashboard. Now you will send at least 30 to 50 emails to the top bloggers in each country every day and it is not difficult so you can do it easily. And one another method is to go on YouTube and search the keyword tips on how to design business card. So YouTube will show you thousands of video on this keyword. Now from here open the videos one by one. So for demonstration I will open this one. And then you will need to open the profile of this YouTube channel. So for that you will click here on the name of this YouTube channel. And then here on the right side you will see links to the website of this YouTuber. 
and also you will see the links to their social media accounts and one more thing if you click here on the about tab and if you scroll down so here in the details section you will see the email address of this youtuber so you can also send him an email from here or you will see the links to their social accounts and their website from here so in this way you will contact bloggers and youtubers and you will ask them to sign up as an affiliate on your drop servicing website now suppose you are sending 30 emails to bloggers and 10 emails to youtubers every day so that's mean you will contact around 1200 bloggers and youtubers in just one month now let's say for demonstration half of them or let's say 500 of them sign up on your website as an affiliate and 500 affiliates means 500 backlinks to your website from different blogs and youtube videos now let's say each one of these 500 backlinks get only 10 clicks per day I am taking a very minimum estimate of 10 clicks if a blog have high traffic so you will get hundreds of clicks from a single blog every day but let's say each one of these 500 affiliates send only 10 visitors to your website per day so 500 multiplied by 10 equal to 5000 clicks so you will get 5000 clicks to your website every day and then 5000 multiplied by 30 days equal to 150 thousands which mean in one month you will get 150 thousand clicks to your drop servicing website now you have to note here one thing these 150 thousand visitors to your website are potential customers why because they are visiting your website from a relevant source they were reading a blog post or watching a youtube video on the same topic for which you are providing a service so that's mean they have a high interest rate in your service and chances are more that they will buy your service but let's say only 0.5 percent of that 150,000 potential customers make a purchase from your website remember 0.5 percent is a very minimum estimate we are considering for this demonstration there are high chances that you will convert from 5 to 7% of that 150,000 visitors as your customer because of their high interest rate in your service. But still, 0.5% of 150,000 is 750 orders in just one month. And let's say you have a $30 margin in each order. It depends on the service you are providing maybe you have a hundred dollar margin or 200 but for this example let's say you have only 30 dollars margin in each order so 30 dollars multiplied by 750 orders equal to 22,500 dollars in just one month now remember one thing here that our estimation for this demonstration was too small we consider only 10 clicks per day from each affiliate and we consider only 0.5% conversion rate and we consider the margin only $30 in each order. If you get more clicks to your website, if you have a high conversion rate and if you have a high margin in each order, then you would have a more high earning at the end of every month. Now don't you think this is the best work from home job? All you do is sitting at home, sending and receiving emails and using this strategy and one more thing you need is a drop servicing website which I will teach you in this course step by step that how you can build a beautiful, professional and responsive drop servicing website using WordPress and without touching a single line of code. Now the second strategy to get clients for your drop servicing website is using affiliate network websites. This strategy is partially pre and partially paid. But before we discuss this strategy, let me tell you what are affiliate network websites. So affiliate network websites are like Clickbank, Commission Junction, Wiglink, and if you Google alternative of Clickbank or alternative of Commission Junction or alternative of Wiglink, so you will get a list of affiliate network websites. Now these affiliate network website have built a system for both affiliate and merchants together. 
Most of the big affiliate network websites have thousands of merchants and millions of affiliates on their website. Merchants sign up on these websites as advertisers and they add their website products and services on these websites. While affiliates sign up on these websites as publishers to choose a product or service to promote from thousands of merchant products and services. The affiliate earn a commission on each successful sale they make for the merchant. But this whole procedure is controlled by the affiliate network website. For example, signing up of the affiliate, tracking the sales, generating affiliate links, receiving earned commission from the merchants, and paying it to the affiliates. So merchants make the total payment of earned commissions directly to the affiliate network website at the end of the month and then the affiliate network website make payments to each individual affiliate. The difference between the PUS strategy and this strategy is that in the PUS strategy you have to personally contact the bloggers or YouTubers to sign up them on your website as an affiliate. But in this strategy, when you sign up as a merchant on an affiliate network website, so you get into the pool of thousands of affiliates. So there are more chances that more affiliate will start promoting your services. The second difference is that in the PUS strategy, you have to control the affiliate procedure, for example, paying the commission and signing up of the affiliates. While in this method, the affiliate network website controls the whole procedure for you. But the problem is that very few affiliate network sites are free and most of them are paid. For example, some affiliate network websites have a fixed one-time sign-up fee, while some have a monthly fee, while some are free but they will ask you for an advance deposit. So you can do your own research on it by checking each of these affiliate network websites. Just google alternative of CJ or alternative of Clickbank and you will get a list of affiliate network websites, then check the details of each one. But I will recommend you to use the PUS strategy in the beginning of your drop servicing business and when you make some money, then go ahead and sign up as a merchant with some good affiliate network website. Now the third strategy to get clients for your drop servicing business is to do paid marketing. But as I said earlier in this lecture that we will discuss something different in paid marketing strategy. So normally when people are doing paid marketing, they simply create ads on social media like Facebook, Instagram, YouTube or Google and they target audience in their ads. So that is also a good method for getting clients but my strategy in paired marketing is retargeting and remarketing. Retargeting and remarketing means targeting only those people in your ads who visited your website but did not buy your service. So through retargeting you can retarget these visitors of your website in an ad and you will provide them a discount coupon and you will encourage them in your ad to buy your service. Later in this course I will teach you how to create discount coupons for your site. So by doing this you will convert a big number of your website visitors as your customers because we know that the people who visited your website once are potential customers and have a high interest rate in your service. So you can easily sell them your service by providing them a discount coupon in your retargeting ads. Now if you remember in the first strategy, we consider that our affiliate are sending 150,000 visitors to our drop servicing website every month. Then we consider that only 0.5% of those visitors bought a service from us. But still, 99.5% of these visitors did not buy anything. Now what if we retarget these 99.5% visitors in our ads on Facebook or Google and we provide them a discount coupon and encourage them to buy our service. So there are high chances that you will convert a big number of these audience. But suppose you converted only 5% of these 99.5% visitors using this strategy. So still 5% conversion means 10 time increase in your earning. Because if you remember, by 0.5% conversion your earning was around 22k dollars. But now 
5% conversion rate will make your earning around 220k dollars. Now you can imagine the power of this strategy. Now briefly I will tell you how retargeting and remarketing ads works. So first of all, if you want to target the visitors of your website on Facebook, so you will create Facebook Pixel in your Facebook ad account. Facebook Pixel is a few line of code that track visitors on your website and the action they take on your website. Then the step 2 is to install that Facebook Pixel in your website header section. And doing this on WordPress website is very easy. So after installing the Facebook Pixel on your website, it will start tracking the visitors on your site. And then when you want to retarget the visitors of your website, you will simply create an ad on Facebook. And during ad creation, you will choose custom audience in audience targeting. And then you will choose website traffic option in targeting. Now after this, Facebook will give you options like who you want to target in your website visitors. For example, anyone who visits your website or people who visit specific pages are people visiting specific web pages but not others. Now here you have to remember one thing that you will target anyone who visited your website but you will exclude those visitors who visited your website checkout page. Because if a visitor of your website has reached to the checkout page of your website, that's mean he has already bought the service from you and you don't need to target him again in your ad. Because checkout page is where a customer is supposed to do the payment. So once a visitor reached to the checkout page, that's mean he made the payment and bought your service already. So you don't need to target him again in your ad. So you will choose here anyone who visited our website but did not visit the checkout page. Now after this you will create your ad and you will add a budget for your ad and then you will publish it. After publishing your ad, it will start running on Facebook. Now, anyone who visited your website once, when they log into their Facebook account, they will see your ad in their newsfeed or in their messenger or in their stories. And when they see your ad with a discount price, so already they were interested in your service and now when they see a discounted price, so chances are more that they will click on your ad. And after clicking on your ad, they will land on your drop servicing website. And there is a high possibility that this time they will buy your service. Now, if you want to retarget the visitors of your website with Google Ads, so in the similar way, you will create a tracking code in Google Ad Manager and you will install that tracking code on your website. And then you can retarget the visitors of your website with Google Ads. So I will add resources in this course on how to do retargeting and remarketing on Google and Facebook so you will learn it from there in details. So these were the three mastermind and highly effective strategies for getting clients for your drop servicing business. Now the next thing is how to build your drop servicing website and how to build and design the landing page for your drop servicing website. So there are a lot of landing page builders but they are very expensive. For example, GetResponse, Kartra, and ClickPunnel. ClickPunnel will charge you around $97 every month. Kartra and GetResponse will charge you around $99 every month. And the problem is you will also need to buy your own domain name, which will charge you around $15 extra. And they will not provide you the option to create your own professional email, like admin at your website name.com. So I will not recommend you to use these landing page builders, but instead I will teach you how to create a beautiful, professional and highly responsive drop servicing website and landing page with WordPress. And it will cost you only 5 or 6 dollars per month. So if you are using Kartra or GetResponse or ClickPunnel, it will cost you around 1200 to 1300 dollars per year, but with WordPress the same thing will cost you around $70 per year. That's mean $70 per 12 months. And also, I will teach you how to get a pre.com domain name per one year. And also, I will teach you how to create your own professional emails per pre. 
so stay with me this course will not take much of your time because i will be keeping everything to the point and if you completely watch this course so it will be your life changing decision because you will learn something new today if you are enjoying this course please provide me a rating and review on this course this will really encourage me thank you for watching this lecture see you in the next lecture